Where are we? <laughs> We're here? <laughs> hey, welcome to Arizona Living with Rob Scribner. Let's get started. We're heading up the desert trail park. And uh, trying to get up to the peak on a wonderful Friday evening here in Arizona. And we're hoping not to see any bears or tigers. Or lions. Or lions. And uh, trying to have a heart attack. Believe it or not, this is only a block away from our house. And we're in Mesa. And uh, it's kind of cool. Well, it's getting higher. I think we're at five or 6,000 feet now. <laughs> well, maybe not. How's that for a view, guys? I know. This would have been a good time for a gimbal. I'm pretty sure we're up to 12,000 feet. And uh, we are at the top of the little peak. Oh, that's a pretty good view. That's gone a little past that big hole. Yeah, I know. So yeah, it's kind of pretty. Let me come around this way so you can see this. Well, the sunset's gone, but it's still pretty, pretty sky back there. So we have parks like this all over the place. This one's just a little one. This is made for uh, trail bike, well, bikes. Bike. What do you call, uh, what do you call those? BMX. Well, these are for BMX bikes well, and trails, but oh, it's nice. really, it's really kind of cool. Kind of neat for young and of course adults come here. But uh man you can see a long ways. It's kind of birdie. So if you ever get out here in Arizona, there's no reason not to get some exercise. Unless it's too hot. That's why we waited till so long to come. Yeah, that's why we came up here in the evening. Because if we did this in the daytime, we'd still be trying to get up the hill. So this is kind of interesting for the BMX guys. The sign says here, Black Diamond Expert Level, Double Trouble Flow Trail. <laughs> I don't think we'll be going that way, but uh, you can kind of see right there, it kind of goes into a loop, and uh, they got jumps and all kinds of stuff on this hill, so uh, make sure you wear a crash helmet if you're going to come up here with your bicycle. Man, but uh, yeah, this, I mean... I'm going to turn this around so you can see the parking lot, but uh, this looks like a good place to get hurt on a bike. But yeah, Desert Trail Park in Mesa, pretty cool. Well that was an example of a, of a park that's here in Arizona, but I guess what I'd really like to talk about is, is throughout Phoenix, throughout Arizona, all the different little cities around here, Phoenix, Tempe, Gilbert, Mesa, on and on. Throughout all the cities, there are beautiful, beautiful parks. And not only are there parks, it's parks with water, lakes. You go, what? In Arizona? And uh, yeah, they're, they're all over the place. Even in developments, uh, there's man-made lakes throughout the cities. And they're beautiful and a lot of them you can fish they actually put fish in them and some of them you can rent boats and uh yeah it's just amazing some people take their kayaks to uh some of them i think the tempe lake a lot of people do uh uh the boarding um i can't remember what they call it but uh yeah it's really common and so uh and and throughout the area we have a lot of buttes and stuff like that there's hiking trails, Camelback's a real uh, famous one, but there, there's several of them throughout the areas. So uh, there's no excuse to think that just because it's hot here in Arizona, that there isn't beautiful places to go. One of the favorite things I like about Arizona is you're actually outdoors a lot more. You're not cooped up. Even though where it's really, really, really hot, it's only for a short period of time. So when you go to restaurants, the option to eat outside, very common. 
if you just want to grab uh, maybe some KFC chicken and then take that food and go to the nearest park and I can guarantee you there's several of them and go enjoy a beautiful park maybe a park with a lake uh, playgrounds oh my gosh there's all kinds of stuff for the children there's one park that actually has a little uh, railroad small train that goes around the lake and a playground for the kids it's beautiful with beautiful water and people fishing we're catching nice fish and uh, uh, water fountains and all kinds of stuff and then there's the beautiful uh, fountain hills which has got a 500 foot fountain that goes off every hour so yeah there's a lot of beauty here in Arizona and uh, you know the first thing you think is oh this it's dry and there's no water there's water everywhere so yeah it's just uh, kind of blows your mind a little but uh, anyway uh, that's one of the things I really love about this state is so much beauty and so many fascinating animals and plants and things like that but our parks are over the top they're just beautiful parks everywhere and uh, we just want to spend a great day having a picnic and have the kids have grass to play in and and lots of uh, uh, toys to play on and adventures Arizona's got it so I want to thank you very much for uh, watching Arizona Living and we'll see you in the next show bye now hey thanks for watching Arizona Living please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world we'd really appreciate that Till next time, bye.